Hello friends, we are meeting up with some gap. How do you do? Doing well. Okay, now lockdown is being relaxed slowly. But still we have to be very careful for a long time, longer period. So take care. Okay, right. Today I have chosen three idioms. That is life is one medium. Then lend your ears. Lend a helping hand. Uh, so, uh, these are the idioms I have chosen. My parents are my life. That is uh, very important. Somebody most important, uh, somebody, uh, something most important. That is, uh, journalism is my life. Without journalism, that is my career or subject which I am going to choose. So, journalism is my life. Whether it is a career or now you are joining the study. Eh? Uh, so, this is important in my life. So, that, is, that, is, that itself is my life. How essential it is, we understand. My parents are my life. They are life for me. They, I consider them first in my life. I love them. I respect them. I help them a lot. They are my life. So, journalism is my life. And then regarding career, you can say my career, my present career is my life. Very important for me. Project. This project, you know, is uh, very important. It's my life. It may decide my life. Maybe, you know, if I do it well, uh, this may uh, help me to go higher in life. Like that, you know. So, uh, you can express uh, uh, this uh, idiom uh, very beautifully in a daily speech. Flowers, children, or children will bring a dull room back to life. That is back to life. Another expression, idiomatic expression. That is back to life means uh, without children, without uh, beautiful flowers, decorations, you know, the room may look dull. That is, we may not be engaging ourselves very actively. Uh, so, but when they come to the room, uh, they bring back life to the room. So, many uh, times it happens. Uh, when children come and play around us, uh, everything becomes ex exciting, interesting, uh, full of noise. Uh, very happy we feel. So, flowers or children will bring a dull room back to life. What's the meaning? To make something uh, that is uh, vibrating with life. That is uh, to make something more interesting and exciting. So, they will bring great vib vibration into anything uh, that is uh, to anything uh, that is that they do. Children and then the flowers, you know, looking very beautiful, colorful, uh, bright. So, we get cheered when, they, when we look at flowers. So, very interesting, exciting. So, then one more expression here, you know, the match came to life, finally in the second half, came to life. Otherwise, you know, it was a bore. Until then, it was a bore, not at all interesting. That is, came back, came to life means very active, very interesting, interesting, exciting. The second half was very good, very nice, interesting to watch. So, uh, the same match came to life uh, finally in the second half. So, in all these ways, you can express this idea. He had no mind to lend his ears regarding his uh, plan to leave. So, he has a plan to leave somewhere and then he had no mind. That is, he was not willing at all to lend his ears uh, to us. That is, uh, uh, we, he doesn't want to say, uh, share it uh, with us. Uh, and then he had uh, no mind to share it with us. Lend, lending one's ears means uh, listening patiently to us, to one who wants to talk to them. So, uh, he had uh, no mind to lend these ears. Lend me your ears, please. Let me have a few words with you. Lend me your ears means uh, please listen to me patiently, please. So, sometimes parents also uh, tell their children, friends, uh, between friends, among friends, uh, uh, we can use uh, this uh, medium. Then, I was waiting to see if I can lend a hand. I was waiting to see another expression. That is, I was waiting to see if I can lend a hand. Lend a hand means if I could do something to help him or her. If, if I can help, that is, uh, to help somebody. I was waiting. I was waiting for a chance. Uh, to see whether I can get a chance to lend a hand, help. So, always must be ready to lend a hand to the sufferers and the poor. Then, beauty is only skin deep. Common expression, idiot. Consider her total uh, personality. 
that is regarding alliance. You may say it uh, to a boy or a girl. That is, uh, beauty alone is not life. So, beauty is only skin deep. That is, uh, external appearance. That is, uh, the look, the look of a person. So, beauty is only skin deep. Consider her total personality. That is, she may be very, uh, that is, kind, intelligent, smart, uh, uh, very social, uh, sociable. Uh, well, she may have many other merits. So, may not be good looking, very good looking. So, beauty is only skin deep. That is, external look is less important than, um, that is, uh, uh, character, one's character, one's personality, one's attitude. So, please uh, learn all these uh, medium and expressions, which will help you a lot in daily conversation. It will enrich your speech. So, uh, please do it. And uh, as usual, uh, please uh, subscribe. Make your friends, relatives, uh, and uh, others uh, whom you know, uh, sus uh, subscribe. Make them subscribe. Please uh, make a request to them on my behalf. Uh, and it's time for me to say bye to you. Bye. Thank you.